it really pretty this morning. We've got a little bit of cloud cover on the eastern plains. Here's the view from our Viero camera there in Ray. This was one of the spots yesterday where we had some stronger storms roll through uh, to the north and west of there up and through Weld County is where it was really active yesterday. More storms possible again today. There is going to be a slight risk again of severe weather and with a few of these storms, the biggest uh, threat would be likely again some large hail. We saw it yesterday hail up to about two inches in diameter, so about golf ball to hen egg size hail up across the northeastern corner of the state and you can see today here in town one of the other threats will be air quality. We're under an air quality warning for those uh, uh, ozone levels until four o'clock this afternoon. It's going to get warm again. Right now you're stepping out the door to mainly upper 50s to low 60s. A pretty start in Denver. Relative humidity at 81%. You definitely felt that in the atmosphere yesterday afternoon. Some higher humidities for us and, and some unstable weather due to it. Now Lakewood right now 63. Highlands Ranch is at 62. And in Aurora currently 61. With that unstable weather, the risk of severe weather is going to cover pretty much the exact same spot as it did yesterday. There in yellow, where we're likely going to see some of the stronger storms. So again, parts of Weld County and just clipping the western edge of the metro area. Likely our storms here in town will fire up around 2 to about 5 o'clock. And then they'll be over the northeastern plains through dinner time. 60s this morning. And again, you'll see on Futurecast how by about 12 o'clock, we're still under a mostly sunny sky, low 80s by that point by lunchtime with a few thunderstorms then popping up right around two. Those will get a bit stronger across the northeastern plains through early evening. Likely going to see a pretty good lightning show with also some pockets of heavier rain. Early tomorrow, skies will have cleared out. We'll see a mix of sun and clouds. A few more thunderstorms possible tomorrow, but our risk of severe weather is going to be quite a bit lower on Thursday. Low to mid 90s Thursday and Friday. So we've got some pretty big warm ups in store as we head into the weekend. Saturday and Sunday, two of the warmest days on our seven day with Jason highs in the mid to even upper 90s.